Thomas, would you have a, a game like tonight, obviously 20, 30 and 20? Do you, is there a different feeling? I mean, are you just, in your mind, are you just, is everything clicking, or is it just the same as 10 and 10? Um, no, I wouldn't say it's the same as 10 and 10. It's like, you know, once I get to a certain you know, amount of rebounds and a certain amount of points, and then I look at the time, you know, there's 15 minutes left, you know, I just try to keep trying to, you know, beat that and just keep trying to go off that. It's to the point where I'm playing against myself. So, yeah. And out there tonight, what did it feel like? I mean, um, it definitely was a great accomplishment um, to get that. And, you know, the coach's biggest thing before the game was to get momentum rolling into the conference. So, you know, that's all I wanted to do tonight was, you know, send a message and get a full of team to the conference. Thomas, uh, it seemed like every time you did get in the post, they tried to double you pretty hard. Is, you know, the, the 30 points, is that almost a testament to your guards finding you in good spots to, to get no, past No, that's, that's the testament to my guards hitting shots, you know, and um, me passing out of the double teams was what made them in the second half. I think they had to back off me a little bit, you know, and that just opened my offensive game up for me. Mm -hmm. Thomas, how much would you say your game has improved in, in the last year? I can't even really put it in words, but I mean, I know I'm a better basketball player, you know, I'm definitely more patient, you know, I just know more about the game and, you know, it's, it's all about, you know, having more experience on the floor, you know, and I think we're still getting better as a player. What do you I, think I, of I, your first three of your career? <laughs> well, <What? the> baby. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Tyshawn, you, you've obviously played with some great players, um, more twins and Cole and um, some other guys. Where does Thomas rank? I mean, Right up there, I think. Um, I think the same way the twins after their sophomore year, that summer going into their junior year, the way they were in the gym was like, I never seen anybody work that hard. Like they were in the gym more than anybody. And I think Thomas is the same way after his sophomore year coming into this year. He just that summer he just was in the gym. He was just working harder than everybody, and it's showing. I mean, he, he's a beast today, and he's been he's been playing like a beast for us. So um, I hope he can get a couple more of these thirty twenties, man. Tyshawn, you know? <laughs> strange to ask when you see his final numbers, but could you make the argument you didn't get it inside enough in the first half? I, I don't know. I don't no, think so. I, I definitely mean, got the ball enough. Yeah, I think I think he just did a good job of fanning it out, and, and I think that's what one of the things that Coach kind of stresses the t Rob a little bit is that, I mean, our offense is kind of going to run through him, so he doesn't really have to force it too much. And so when they trap him, if he passes it back and we swing it a couple more times, He's going to have an opportunity to be one-on-one -on -one in the post, and that's how we won it. So um, he did a really good job today. He had a career high in assist, too, I think, four or five. And so that just shows how he uh, was passing it out and, and being patient and letting the game come to him and not trying to force it. And I think that just that just goes to show how much he's improved as a player and, and, and having a better understanding of the game. Thomas, what was your goal this offseason when, when you started working? Um, to be able to meet, I mean, yeah, to be the best player in the country, obviously. I mean, definitely to, to meet all the expectation that was set for me. You know what I mean? It was it was something that I never seen before and I knew that everything that's coming at me this year is something I never faced and I didn't wanna, you know, let anybody down. We still have a long year ahead of me, but you know, like I said so far, you know, I didn't I didn't wanna not meet those expectations. So I try to set mine as higher than everybody else's. How important has Coach Manny been in your development? Uh, everything, you know, with, with D Man and, and the twins and Cole being here for the past three years with me. Well, not the twins and Cole, but I mean, with them being here helping me, me playing against them, and D-Man just teaching me everything, you know, from the ins and out of the game, you know, it just helped me, you know, overall. You know, before I came in, I was out of control, you know. I was just a raw athlete, but, you know, he, he slowly would turn me into, you know, a better player. Hey, Travis, how much of an awareness was there that this was the last regular you know, non-conference game, and now it's kind of on with conference play? Uh, it was a bunch of awareness. I mean, coming into this game, Coach was just saying that, we need to get after it and get momentum going into the tournament. So I mean, going into conference. So that's what we came out and did. Big touch on this. Obviously, this will be your last home game against K State Wednesday. To you, what does this rivalry mean? How important is it to get to start off with the win? Um, I mean, this is this has been one of the best rivalries I played in since I've been here. I think. Um, I think I think sometimes the K State rivalry is underplayed because Mizzou is so big. But I think um, I enjoy playing K State a little bit more. So this is going to be a fun game, man. Um, I'm excited for it. I'm excited to get conference started and, um, you know, get this thing on the road. You know, um, they're going to come in here with, with a lot of energy. They're going to play hard. I mean, we all know they're well coached. And so um, we just got to be prepared. We got to play hard. And, I mean, we got to rebound better than we have been. I think that's going to be a big a big key against them. But, um, like I said, I, I'm excited for conference to start. You look at the box score in U3 and, and Elijah had 
the, the bulk of the points. Uh, is that kind of what you guys expect? Maybe you're going to have to do in, in conference play against, against these teams. I think we got. I mean, those are the guys that's going to play most of the minutes. So I think it's probably going to. That's how it's going to happen. That's how it's going to look for a lot of the games. Is us for being the leader scorers and, and I mean, kind of filling up a stat sheet for our team. But um, guys like Connor, guys like you know, Kevin can come in and, and play good for us. You know, we've seen that. And I mean, are we just going to keep playing. I think the coach understands how you want to play us, how you spread the minutes out, things like that. So um, we're just going to make the best of our opportunities while we're out there. Are you guys working more on the lob lately? The lob dunk? You know, where you. Nah, I don't think we're working more on it than we've ever had. I think it's just. It's always been a part of our offense. We just, two rounds a big target, man. We just go throw it up there. <laughs> just throw it up there. You're going to get it. So, yeah. Thanks, bro. <laughs> hey, Thomas. What, the four assists that you had today, I thought was significant, too. Would you tell me about the importance of assists to you. Um, well, like I said, you know, if, if I didn't get those assists, then I probably wouldn't have 30 points. You know, coach been stressing to me for um, – 90% of the season so far, <laughs> that if I just, you know, learn how to play the game, you know, outside of the double team, that, that I'll eventually, the offense will come for me. And I, I kind of fought it a little bit, you know, for so far during the season. But I mean, you know, I'm finally listening to him and the man that we're talking about. So. <laughs> Anything else, guys?